Hello and welcome to some gameplay of Rift. Rift is an MMO that I haven't really been playing a lot since I first tried it initially. Uh, back then I played about one month hardcore and I got to the max level at that uh, expansion, the first expansion. And then I was basically done with the game quite fast after because I got pretty bored. But every now and then I like to log into this beautiful game and just play it maybe do a level or two and then kind of just forget about it the game works brilliantly uh, first I want to emphasize the marker system is amazing in this game basically right now I'm in a leveling spec that is called Grandpa uh, it's for the rogue at I would say around 25 maybe a little lower you can already start using the spec and basically you just use about 5 macros and then you also have your stealth and a few cooldowns and your self buffs like um, Ebon blades or hellfire blades that basically just like poison in World of Warcraft and then you have your few major cooldowns to save your life so the rope is sort of like a tank but also has some roguelike abilities, well completely roguelike abilities, but they still have this kind of tanky feel even when they are out leveling in a DPS spec and that is what I really loved about uh, this spec initially when I started leveling my rogue again this spec along with its macros are just amazing so if you're going to be playing this game I really want to emphasize using the macro system because the markers just makes for much more easier and smooth gameplay so you can focus on other things like enjoying the scenery because the game is really beautiful when you have max uh, settings I would say with my build, which is a pretty high end build it's not that hard to max it and get easy 60 frames via living but it's still uh, it's a pretty heavy game to do on most uh, PCs so I wouldn't uh, recommend uh, trying this with anything less than say uh, a second generation uh, Intel Core maybe even a Core Core CPU and then nothing less than a 400 GTX series so that's like pretty demanding to even just play it but it's a free game nowadays and that's what I really like about it just just because I can jump in and then play it whenever I feel like and then log out and forget about it and the game just has everything you can expect from a MMO it basically has all these really good UI things like the marker system and then it has this amazing UI right now I only have well about five add-ons in total installed compared to World of Warcraft where I have like 40 add-ons and I would say each of those 40 add-ons are pretty important because the standard UI in uh, World of Warcraft doesn't have that and that is what I really love about when when I started out playing uh, Rift I really loved the interface the interface is just so easy and it doesn't require a lot of uh, time to get it looking nice and it's easy to play around with and you can always change it however you like I would also say that the game is still quite alive I see a lot of people online in this random guild that I'm in right now um, I can't even remember now when I got into uh <laughs> uh, as you can see it's pretty long time since I actually uh, played it properly so this is the guild, yeah, and I'm pretty sure I can go in on info. Yeah, as you see here, this random guild has quite a few online, so it's not a completely dead game, even almost uh, mid-2015, but it's not as alive as it one was, even if it's a free game, not many people are playing it which is kind of sad because the game is really nice the only thing I don't like about this game is that it's pretty demanding a game to play when I didn't have my new computer this was pretty hard to play on my old one where whoa it was really no problem so that can be a barrier for a lot of people I know it was for me myself but um, anywho let's go and do some gameplay 
I really love the stealth in this game, it looks so awesome. And in general, Rogue, if you're really looking for like a melee class, the Rogue is just awesome in this game. So many good specs. Uh, the tank tanking in this is probably my favorite in any MMO ever. The tanking, wow, I don't get me started, it's just so great. You have all these mobility and teleport things that really just makes the game great. And that is what I re initially loved about the rogue. And that is why I stuck with it to max level back when I started the game. Anywho, let's try and take on two mobs here. I'm quite on the levels and you will uh, see that the leveling is not that easy in the game. But with a nice marker system, at least I don't have to stress too much about the combat being hard or whatever. Oh, a guy helped me out. I think he pulled them off. <laughs> oh, that's silly. Well, we can try and do this little grift here. As you see now, when you go up to the rift in the game, which is plentiful of them, you nowadays get an automatic group confirmation. That is a really cool thing. These sort of things would be awesome if World of Warcraft had them. They kind of just make you more interactive in the world. And uh, I think it bugged out. No, that's because there's a mob over here. So let's see if he will follow me, because this mob is pretty deadly. We have has 100k life. Takes me a little time to kill it. No. Seems like the uh, guy left. Then we can do a bit of questing ourselves. <laughs> and if I really love the start, so I'm gonna get right now for the turn uh, expansion fight. It looks awesome. But this is the uh, boss fight now, the rift. Clearly, it was a little weird, but um, let's see if we can do this. Oh, we need to kill the, uh, the other mob first. So, let's clear these out. This is pretty easy when we are two, so it's not an issue pulling quite fast. Oh, and they are all the way over there. Now I do have some range uh, and mobility on this spec, but it's not a lot. So mainly I just have to go in as many range, which is a bit annoying. That's because you could kind of want like a charge or something, which uh, my field droid has in one of Warcraft. I really, I really love the mobility of charge, but this class doesn't uh, have charge. Anything. So yeah. It's a bit of a slower tank, maybe kind of low compared to the uh, World of Warcraft world, I would say. Oh, now I've got a special mod here, that's always cool. But they make the mix a little easier with special abilities, you can pick up while you're doing it. And you will be a free kill in the group now as well, so that makes it uh, an easy clear. I'm quite surprised that I even get to see two other people in this rift. Usually the rifts are not very popular when you're leveling. And now I died. <laughs> I don't even know what killed me right there. But um, anyway, I can soon walk, so that's always nice. As you can see, the other two are level 60. I'm 58, so I do take a little risk being in this zone as a newbie. I think that was it. No, that's one guy left. Double bonus! The power of nightmares now will only a give you more. false hope! I actually got a quest item, that's funny. But, um, I just keep playing this one. I just have to kind of watch out not to die. Oh, I can see the mate here 
doing quite a good amount of damage. I can't really contribute that much to the But then I can at least take the part of the highest health mobs. <laughs> But anywho, the marker system is really great. Uh, you can always Google Grandpa Road Spec if you want to learn it with that. It really just pushing a few buttons. That's just so relaxing had to move to that mode where you maybe have 10, 15, 15, 15, 15. I like the simplified combat system in games usually. That's probably also why you know, games like uh, Diablo is really appealing to me. You don't have to have these complex rotations 24 7. It's going to be a bit stressful to play at times. Special abilities are uh, pretty cool to pick up while you're doing this. I don't recall seeing so many special abilities. This must also be a new thing that they have added recently. So let's go. Oh, look at this one. Cast on order to create a damaging ground effect. That's cool. So that's like an AoE effect. Yeah. For the next stage, bonus stage. Okay. okay, this is like a boss. 300, 400k health. That's a bit. But when we get three people, they die pretty easily. Yeah. I did die one die for some dead earth. Glad I didn't take the heart. And we got some. Container on the wall again. And now we can go and put this guy out. And now we have four people together. That's pretty sweet. Oh, I'm gonna make that a little bit. Put on the map there. Okay, now I got the plan. I think they maybe have a scale. The more people we are, you know. So now can actually do some which is where we still do try to do lots of numbers on screen there. The area for this spec is amazing. You basically have to just use two buttons instead of three. You build your combo points and then you use your finisher and that is both for uh, and AD. but the area is just like wow <laughs> it is so good and easy to use no patient requirements so you don't have to save the magic and you're just uh, spaying around like crazy Yeah, it both has a really and a really good, but a really good. That's probably also why a lot of people choose this place when they play a role for this. Wow, now I got the answer from this massive map. Oh, that's it. Oh, we have to dodge the red circle. That's kind of cool. Oh, wow, you see this circle? Cool. The boss has almost 2 million health. That's quite a bit. I wonder what they want. Oh, I have to move out of there. Oh, we got a special ability to Well, it's gonna go down 50% already. Some people doing a lot of damage, not me. I'm doing like 5k, and the others are almost 10k. <laughs> yeah, I can't really come to this when I am so low level. They maybe also have a lot more gear than me in the quest initially. But um, now the boss will die in just a short while. And that's 
stuff. Now the Mr. Bomb this was pretty good with looks awesome as well with the eye, the sky. I really like that. And I got an achievement, let's see what that is. Only close to an experience. Okay, so that was actually a hard wish. Uh, let's keep on the wall. Oh, lots of planetarium and then lots of infinity stones. That's kind of cool. And let's play out the rest of the mods. If there's any left at all. Two left. Not many. That's a huge bug. And this is kind of typical for the rift, I guess, at the, at the more modern, high level areas nowadays. Usually, I remember the list being quite smaller than this one, so it was good to see a big bus come out of the end. And I think we will end it now. So, it kind of continues. Yeah, there's like a bonus stage. Anywho, I think I will end the video here. And look at those eyes, scary shit. <laughs> Anywho, I hope you liked the video and maybe you will consider trying Rift out yourself. It's a pretty good game and it's for free to play. So nothing to lose there. Anywho, goodbye.